Charlotte Douglas getting back to normal at this hour after dozens of American Airlines flights were canceled overnight because of severe weather. Pop up thunderstorms resulted in 35 flight diversions, 64 cancellations. It left many passengers with nowhere to go and forced them to sleep right there in the airport on the floor. WCNC Charlotte's Richard Devane talked to passengers this morning and has more. Yeah, good afternoon, guys. I'm here taping this in the morning just so you can get a look at how hectic the scene was here at Charlotte Douglas this morning after severe weather blew through the area, causing cancellation of a number of flights, dozens of flights last night. Now, what happened was a lot of folks stranded at airports. They could not go to hotels because the hotels were quickly booked up in the area. They couldn't get rental cars to drive to their destinations because all of those were gone. There were people with all types of stories about being stuck in the airport being stuck on planes as they waited out the bad weather only to then have to get off the airplane and wait in the in the airport a lot of frustration a lot of people upset the airline saying it's doing what it can to try to get their passengers on their way but as you can well imagine this left a lot of passengers very frustrated you know they say oh we can't give you blankets pillows or right. cots because yeah. of covid um all the hotels were sold out. Yeah. As far as what could they do, they could have flight crew available. If you yeah. have planes scheduled, why are there no flight crews for the yeah. planes that you have yeah. scheduled? It's ridiculous. We're trying to get to Memphis to get to my uncle's funeral. And they're going to bury him today at 11. And we still can't get out of this um, terminal. And of course, Charlotte Douglas says it's also working with the airport, the airline, I should say, to try to get their passengers to their destinations as soon as possible. But as you can well imagine, a lot of folks, both people who were waiting yesterday and passengers who are coming out today are finding themselves having to wait throughout long lines and some will miss even more flights because of this. We're here at Charlotte Douglas, Richard Devane for WCNC Charlotte.